Okay, welcome back. Tip of the day. We're going to show you about minerals versus really not too many minerals. Now, tip of the day, of course, is something that we see that I think would be very interesting maybe for you to want to see. Only if you want to see sometimes some truth. You see other people's truths. So sometimes tips of the days are really other people's truths and sometimes they're my truths and then of course in time sometimes they'll be your truths. So this idea is actually real because you can see this big plant, this tobacco plant, is bigger than one leaf is bigger than the whole plant. So minerals are very essential to grow you in the way you want to. When we dry this plant, this plant is yellow you can see. This one's green. Green. And if you dry this, this turns into just like yellow, just like what you see. There, there's a pyramid, and you can look and see some of the videos we've done on that called the food pyramid, and explains all these levels out really good because it's, it's not that it's hard to understand. It's just that you have to figure out what level of the pyramid you're at and where you want to go if it makes logical sense to you. So the tip of the day is minerals equal conductivity. And without these things, water, minerals, and sunlight, it just doesn't happen, as you can see. Here we go. Now, this is going to be very interesting for your mind if you haven't been doing this. These are seeds, and seeds are very special. If you have seeds, you have life, and if you have life, you have actually what you really need and are, are what really everybody's searching for is food. So these are avocado seeds. Uh, these are chilies, all different types of plants. What we're talking about is actually taking the seeds that you eat, uh, let's say like an avocado, and you're eating an avocado and you have a seed. What do you do with it? Look what we just did with it. We have been growing all of the things that have seeds. And if we all did this, what do you think we'd have? This avocado has only been here for about, oh, maybe about a month and a half. Look what it's doing. It's growing. It wants to grow. So don't throw it out in the garbage can. That's sort of, well, if you find out that we're all working to get food, that would be blasphemy to throw away a seed if you know that over three billion people don't have food every day. So on Sunday, I call it naturalistic church. Take your seeds of the week, dry them out, wash them, and then plant them, and you'll see that you'll have food for a rainy day. <laughs> and if we all did that, well, you'd see that we'd have a lot of farmers market people going to share what they grow, and they don't have enough, well, people in their family to eat all the food they're growing, so what do they do with it? They share it with others. One other thing before we pass on is looking at this is called a weed maybe, or grass, but this was growing in here. And this is why we need to go ahead and clean ourselves of a lot of different types of parasites because I want this to grow. And it's not a parasite, but it is. It's living off the minimal mineral, minerals that I have in here. And so if I take this away, now this plant, and you can see the root structure in this plant was massive. It was taking away the minerals, so this plant most likely may never grow. So if you have a lot of parasites in your body, it's only because most likely you have the terrain to get them so they can live. More on that later. This one's at, uh, this is at four weeks. On its way to growth, on, on its way to sprouting. This one here is at uh, eight weeks. There we go. And this one is 12 weeks. And that's 16 weeks. That was another edition of Earthshift Kitchen, but Earthshift Kitchen will actually show you things in the kitchen and out of the kitchen because the idea is not just to learn things, but it's actually to be able to have the concepts that go along with why you're doing these things. You don't just follow, of course, the herd because you know the herd, as you can see, is possibly not on the right track. So. This herd over here has a lot to share with you. So join EarthShiftProject.com 
come to our wholesale superfood club <clears throat> and this club has all of these different types of things that you can get under one roof and actually get it shipped right to you. You don't have to go to the store. You don't have to say, oh, they only small, sell small sizes because we sell large sizes too. We're sort of like a bulk uh, wholesale superfoods and product store to make it so this simple transition is actually easy for you to do because if you don't have all these sort of things under one roof, what makes you think that you can do it on your own? It was really hard for us to do this, and this has taken us lots of time to be able to really get together. So um, a lot of people can really jump up this ladder instead of actually spending a lot of time trying to figure out what to do. You can see what others are doing and see the results that they're doing um, and what they're having. It's a transformation. Share your transformation. It's one of the things we want you to do at Earthshift is share what happens to you. Remember, we're all going up the ladder. This sort of physical ladder, this uh, emotional ladder, we're going up this ethereal ladder, we're going up all these different ladders. So um, the only thing we can really do is have the tools and have the people around us to make this so this adventure is not just fun, but it's actually really fun. <laughs> we'll see you next time. All right.